Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and today I'm going to review the 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray edition of The Lost City. If you're new to the channel, please hit the like button, subscribe, hit that bell notification. You can also find me over Twitter, Instagram, and Letterboxd at Movie Guy 365. Okay, The Lost City is here on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray, released by Paramount Pictures. It comes in a slipcover edition, available at your local and online retailers. Now, as far as the film itself, I am a big fan of adventure films in general, and they, I, you know, we get a lot of action, sci-fi, horror, but really just pure adventure films along the lines of Indiana Jones, or in this case, Romancing the Stone. I really feel that you know, when something like this comes along, I'm all in. And of course, this is a bit of a comedy also. It really is about, I would say it's about a 60-40 split between adventure and comedy. And of course you have Sandra Bullock, uh, Channing Tatum, Daniel Radcliffe, who plays a really cool villain. And you know, some appearances from other uh, actors, uh, you know, like Bar Brad Pitt. And uh, uh, you know, it's just, I think it's a fun movie. And you know, once again, comparing it to Romancing of the Stone, it's definitely, it's all but remake in name. It really is. And I think it actually works. Um, some of the locations are gorgeous, which will translate very well into the 4K disc, which I'll talk about in a minute. But yeah, I think it's it's a fun movie. It doesn't take itself very seriously at all. I I do dig it. I think it's it's a fun time, at, you know, just watching it. And, uh, you know, if you're, if you're, you know, interested in a movie like this, Check it out. I, I don't think you'll regret it. It is, it is at the end of the day, it's it's a good, you know, just escapism type of film, man, with a little bit of comedy thrown in. All right, we're going to talk about the picture quality and the audio in just a moment. But first, let's do a quick unboxing. Okay, we have the 4K slipcover edition of The Lost City. Um, you know, standard artwork. It's, you know, simple, but it uh, basically tells the story. Uh, I, I can imagine after having watched the film what a, a nice stylized steelbook would have looked like, but you know, maybe one day they'll do a reprint, but uh, you know, as it stands, it's, it's fine. Uh, and then we have the back. And the spine. And the interior, pretty much the same. And then it's just the 4K disc only, no artwork. So yeah, overall, Pretty nice. Now let's talk about the picture quality and the audio. The Lost City on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray has a 239 by 1 aspect ratio. I wasn't 100% able to confirm whether this was an upscale or a 4K DI, but I'm inclined to believe it was a 4K digital intermediate. It also supports HDR10 and Dolby Vision for the grading, so for purposes of this review, I will be discussing the Dolby Vision encode. Shot digitally, this film's transfer is exceptionally crisp on the 4K formats. So those that prefer modern looking movies looking their best, you are absolutely going to enjoy what you see here. No blemishes or anomalies were present during my viewing. The film's color palette is wonderfully lush. The green of the jungle setting is rich and deep. In fact, all landscapes and environments benefit greatly here. Costuming in general is vibrant and bold, but Bullock's purple sequence dress in particular really shines. Skin tones are warm and they look great. Colorful highlights such as fire during explosions or lighting offer a visual pop. White outfits that Channing Tatum and a few other characters wear look natural and never appear blown out. Dolby Vision enhances colors very nicely throughout the film. Black levels are appropriately deep with nary a sign of elevation. Night sequences look great and it contrasts well with any lighting sources present. Shadow detail is well rendered throughout, no black crush spotted. Gains in detail is appreciable. Close-ups yield the best results of course, once again Bullock's dress is a standout. Facial features exhibit much better detail, sweat, dirt, face lines have greater depth. Location and set pieces also offer texture enhancement. The walls of the temple and caves, for instance, look great. Foliage has some intricate detail present as well. The Lost City on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray supports a Dolby Atmos audio mix. With this being an adventure comedy, I was a little concerned that the sound design would lean a little too heavily into the comedy and less of a robust action film. Thankfully, those concerns proved to not be the case. In fact, this is a pretty exciting audio mix. The Atmos provides a great energetic experience. The soundstage specializes in action scenes, of course, but even the quieter moments have their opportunity to shine. The sound environment is plentiful and engaging. Action-heavy effects immerse the listener with added height channel support offering some worthwhile discrete output. 
gunfire, waterfalls, environmental ambience are all encompassing. Dialogue is clean and clear throughout, even during some of the more chaotic moments throughout the film. And the low end is punchy and robust. It has some excellent presence. For the picture quality, I'm going to give The Lost City on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray an A+. Paramount normally has an excellent track record with their 4K presentation, and this one is no exception. Colors are strikingly bold, the film looks gorgeous, and the Dolby Vision illuminates the screen. This is a beautiful picture and a great looking 4K. For the audio mix, I'm going to give this one an A. Despite having some comedy, this film relies a lot on adventure and the Dolby Atmos handles all those aspects very well. From action scenes to environmental ambience, this is a great sounding 4K and one that you should definitely check out on your home theater. So that is my review of The Lost City on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray. If you're interested in picking up a copy for yourself, I will leave an Amazon link in the comments section. If you use it, it really helps out the channel. But if you have the disc already, let me know your thoughts down below. In the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.